we take you to Brett Favre oh. returning to football. I'll catch the next one. Talk, okay. Hillbilly. <laughs> Hello? Oh, oh, you mean him. Wasn't. Yeah, not you. Um, I'll ask, uh, answer the second part. It was, it was very tough. Um, the mask crack. Um, yeah, I could, I could make a case for both playing, not playing. Um, I think ultimately um, much has been made about the three guys coming down. Um, it was it was really about them, the team. Uh, oh, God. Believe me, I, uh, when I left New Orleans, you know, a big part of me was, I don't want to say done, but the uh, the fact that we lost that game, how hard it is, and it's hard to it's hard to make people understand. Played 19 years, uh, was fortunate enough in '96 to be on a, a winning Super Bowl team, uh, and that was I was fairly young at that time. And you just kind of think, oh, you know, what's the big deal? We'll be back. There's always next year. It's the the toll that it takes, and everyone wants to talk about the physical toll that that uh, you know in that particular game. This game. The, the mental toll is really what is hard to deal with. And, um, you know, this team is a very good football team. The chances here are much greater than, than other places, and there's a lot of teams that could say they have a legitimate chance. This is one of those teams. So from that standpoint, it, it has always made it easier. Um, but, it, you know, it, answering the bell again and – my wife, she always says that I, I look at things negatively. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. More Quit than taking pictures. I think what else she said, says to him. The, yeah. the what ifs. I mean, Sexy. can I Anus. answer the bell? And what happens Anus. if it doesn't? I'd and love to win the Super Bowl. Would love to. Um, but what happens if you don't? Dirt bag. You know, and, and so uh, that was the that was the tough part. Physically, you know. What are you talking about? Oh, that that makes no I mean, sense I, it's at all. It's hard to believe I can say this every year, but I can't complain. You just did nothing it. on me 100. percent There wasn't anything on me 100 percent last year, or the year before. Um, the it's surgeries happy. I think have made made me a little better. Dirt bag. But uh, I mean, I've played 309 straight games. I can't complain. Dirt bag. But you're, you're, you're complaining. So with the ankle, where's where's that at then? I mean, is it's, that a it's big near problem? my foot. Is <laughs> that a no, minor problem? Close to the think foot. The Saints game is the game that forced me to have surgery. I needed surgery three years ago with my ankle. And, and just to kind of, it's a chronic ankle. Um, I had uh, I'd, I had a visit with Dr. Andrews last Thursday, kind of a follow-up visit that we had we had talked about. Um, from the time of the surgery, we did a new X-ray, and surprisingly, there was a new a new spur had had already surfaced in the X-ray, right where he had taken, not as big as what he had taken out. Uh, so he's already but, setting it up that he's playing that hurt. short already. amount of time. It was really surprising because there there is a little pain. What there. a wanker! We thought it was more just scar tissue and things, and that may be part of it. But the fact is, it's just you know. It's just something you have to deal with. There's not a, but I can't there's a little bit more range of motion now since it's the surgery. Yet since but we're started. not talking about a lot. What I was hoping to to resolve was after every day of practice, the soreness that's there. I mean, I'm not going to oh, move it very Lord. much. It's just it's kind of stuck. Nasty. But, um, you know, and every time you sprain an ankle, mine tends to sprain a little bit easier than it did it's early not in my career for obvious reasons. I mean, it's... There's three surgeries on that that particular ankle, and not all of them are relatively the no, same. Not, not complaining. Not type complaining. of surgery, clean out the joint space, try to provide a little mobility. But the you know the bone on bone that you get from uh, you know from moving around and stuff. Everyday walking, no problem. You know, people say, "Well, oh, you look like you're fine." Well, walking's fine. No complaining. Um, playing football, you know. Travis, easy. It, it probably is is not the healthiest thing to do for. You know, for, for your joints and, and things like that. But but you can't complain because it's all know, about the team. All all, uh, it is it is a better. You play, you you play against the, on Sunday, do you think? Or I, I, you get would a like to. I would like to. I took took a lot of reps today, um, oh. much like last year. I mean, I don't, don't 
don't get me wrong, I'm not real excited about getting hit anytime soon. Well, but wait, that is part of it. He still hasn't stopped complaining. Um, okay. and, and the only way you can get, and I got drilled third play of the game last year in the first preseason game against Kansas City. And um, oh, maybe the hardest hit I took all year. Good. Uh, Either play or don't. Quit whining. Uh, yeah, I think there's, there's no substitute for, for calling plays in the huddle. In a, in He's a, redefining Biatch, In a real yeah. game environment. And the only way I'm going to get the speed of the game down Keep Travis warm. Is, uh, is being in. Yes, he's got the satin being jacket in games on. And being in some of the situations like we had today. Blitz <laughs> period. Smoke. Goods against goods. Um, the reaction times. My, arms go, my arm feels great. Oh, but, my uh, To think that it's, you know, it's ready for the first game, uh, that's going to take a little bit of time. But I, that, I'm not really concerned about that. I want the reaction time, get over the initial soreness that. I tend to, or any guy tends to have for a quarterback as you're growing. Still complaining. You know, it's dropping back things that you, you know, the sore, soreness that you get in your shoulder a little bit. Still complaining. Just, you know, in general, get that out of the way. I think if it's anything like last year, after this week, um, to me it's just getting getting familiar with the guys again. I mean, right. for you guys who watch practice today, step right in. Um, I didn't feel like it was midseason for them, but just from a reaction standpoint, but I thought it went rather smoothly. Cocaine is a hell of a drug. All the plays were familiar to me, um, and um, you know, just it's it's getting that guys coming after you, seeing blitzes. What do you do? No, but you can't. That's your bear. You have to do split second time. <laughs> when you played last year, how hard would it have been to walk away knowing that you could still play at a high level? Well, you know, that, that's that's kind of the argument. I, uh, and once again, I can make a case for both. Never in my wildest dreams we sat here last year, but I thought I would play the way I did. I mean, look oh, at it. 18 years previous, I never played that good. And, oh. um, Ray you know, Ray. the good Ray Lord Ray. Had, had blessed me with a lot of talent and ability. And even when I'd lacked in confidence last year, um, going into the season, um, <laughs> you know, I continue to get better and better with each week. And, um, you know, I was even amazed oh my. to think that I could surpass that this year. Uh, first of Mel all, with Travis. They I hang don't out need there. to because uh, as, as well as I played, by far the best I've ever played in my career, it wasn't enough. And that just goes to show you that um, all phases have to be hitting at the right time. And um, But I need to play well, obviously. Need to be a, a great leader. Oh my um, God! All the, th- the intangible things that uh, I really thought would be more important last year than than the statistics. You know, I'm at the end of the year. Oh Lord! Lord. But um, <laughs> you know, part of me said that it was such a great year. Uh, it would be easy to to say, "Hey, can't play any better." That's the party's taking Why pictures of. <laughs> and then the other oh, no, man wants to play better. Guys playing at a, at a high level. That's um, the question that you ask about it. Right? Everything for the most part Sorry, seems to be fine. He's got a good football team around him, and um, and that's true. Um, you know, I, the expectations are high here, as they should be. Um, yeah, from from my standpoint, I can't make any guarantees. Never would. I'm just going to do everything I can to help this football team. I spoke with the guys this morning. I think they know I'm sincere and honest. Um, whatever it takes for us to win, the bottom line is winning. And I'm not here to, to set any records. Um, you know, people, you know, you can do this, you can do this. And I said, I've done it all. There's nothing left for me to prove. Then go away. I'm here to have fun, help these guys win. I How really is it fun if it's so hard guys. on you? I, like you wouldn't believe. And I think the, the feeling is mutual. Um, and so, you know, once again, like going back to, as we started, it, it's, it's really about these guys. Oh, my really God. Is. And I, I know there's, you know, they were joking. Who are you crapping? Oh, look at all the people here. Um, but it's about these guys. It really is. Oh. And, oh. you know, I didn't, from the outside looking in, you may think differently. but oh, what, No, we could think back, differently. Thank you. I think they got mine, too. With the, pain and the, with the pain and the continued range of motion issues in the ankle, where did that rank among the reasons that you would not have come back? Well, it ranked high because a lot like the it's, – it's more of 
I'm not a doctor, but um, for me, conditions that I've had, shoulder, and, and, and the best example is with, with the Jets. I had a torn bicep. Right, they had to complaining. Okay. To get a little He's worse complained the entire I was time. Able to play no, but he it, said he died here to complain. But it wasn't level. Now, I didn't know going into that season that I had right, a torn bicep. Trouble. And it continued to get worse as the season progressed. But now I'm in it. <laughs> you know, it's either you, you know, there's no, um, you can't back out at that point. So Shut up. Before you get into it, Shut that's up. the thing, that the issue that I had to, okay, Shut can up. I do it? Sure. What happens is the second week if it's just, yeah, I can move, but not, I mean, I'm not going to break any 40 records. I can promise you that, but I still feel like my footwork in the pocket is as good as any. Oh, my and Lord. I want, I want Travis being able to throw from, from, yeah. from really and all the positions him. within the pocket. And Baja race. You know, I, I really <laughs> feel like I'm going to have to get from moving around a little bit more. If I fake it to him one way and roll out the other way, I think somebody's going to be open. It's going to buy us a little time. And I think I can do that. So that was the questions I had to ask myself. Can I, you know, do I just think I can do it? Physically? Playing can with I? your we? Uh, Taking pictures of And that's a, that's a major question. You know, and that's what I want somebody to ask I can you. Answer. And I can't promise you if I'll make it through the season. I couldn't promise you that when I was 21. You know, for people to say, oh, you know, he's, December rolls around, he's going to be struggling. They were saying that last year. Come December, I played my best football. Yeah, but you're saying that you're no. in pain. Will that be the case this year? I have that's all no he said. idea. That's all I've heard no so idea. far. All right, that's enough. But I feel, you know, I, I feel as good as I felt last year. And 10th game of the season, I'll probably sit here and tell you, I probably don't feel as good as I did that, that opening press conference. But I would think most guys would feel the same way. Who are you crapping? And, uh, all right, that's it. That's it. I've had enough. Goodbye. Really. I'm not here to complain. I can't complain. My arm hurts. My wang hurts. My ankle hurts. They found things in there. I, I don't know if I, I can't move. I can't do anything. I, oh, boy. But it's, it's not about me. It's not about me. It's about those guys. Those guys are throwing up, too, right now. They won't say it, but they are. We're Boars and Bernstein. Wow. You have the score. I'm... That Brett Favre thing goes up there about him not here to complain. It right, right up there with the Jerry Angelo. I'm not going to use any cliches. Press conference or the Bears saying that they need massive changes, but they <laughs> yeah. value continuity. <laughs> they value continuity. <laughs> I'm not here to complain. Oh, my, 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 shoulder, complain my shoulder hurts. My ankle hurts. Uh, it's not easy because I hurt so much and I can't move. <laughs> you didn't know this. I had a torn bicep when I was a jet, did you? Uh, yeah, as, as a matter of fact, I did know that. Yeah, then you sent out pictures of your ankle and other things. You sent yep. Jen Sturger your wang photos or you're wearing your Crocs, and that's all <laughs> lovely. But, you, but your wife uh, says, <laughs> answer the wang bell. Photos. That, answer actually, the bell it's, it's for it's your teammates. The, it's, it's a special effect, I know, the wang photos. I, I, I And you were right, by the way. I didn't. I thought that the mainstream would maybe catch on to this and ask a tough question about oh, that. Oh, no, no, no. No. No, nope. you're right. They don't want to. They do not okay. want to. They want to make sure that the the Brett story stays all. Uh, where does your ankle rank on things that might have <laughs> kept your ankle you at? away? Where's your ankle at? Oh, Brett, where's your ankle? And how are you in pain? Are you really a warrior? Everybody looks like Uriah Heep in there. <laughs> Should all work for the University of Arkansas Radio <laughs> Network. Yeah, the Allen Florida hats on. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> you know that really is. You know, people get the wrong pr- that right there. Now, see, that's the other extreme of the media. That's just, you know what it is, just embarrassing. That's embarrassing. Those questions. I don't know if they were TV guys. I don't know who the hell they were, but that that's just embarrassing. That's like Jim Rose asking you a question. Where's your ankle at? I have to be a great leader. That's what I have to do. I have to be a great leader. Oh my God. Yeah, oh no, nothing God. says leadership like skipping most of training camp and have, having to have teammates fly down to drag your ass out of the swamp. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> Man. What up? I, again, like I said yesterday, I never would have thought that it, that it would go from where he once was in my mind to where he is now. 